Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to do the matrix operation such as matrix addition, matrix uh, subtraction and matrix multiplication by using the 991 Casio um, MS calculator. Um, matrix operations, uh, especially the um, addition and subtraction, are not very hard to do it by hand manually. However, uh, matrix multiplication is quite a bit difficult to do it by hand and you have a big chance to do the mistake if you are not very careful. So I will show you all three of them, uh, but if you don't like to do the addition and subtraction by calculator, you're welcome to do it by hand. But I'm sure the matrix multiplication will uh, help you if you use your calculator at least to check your answer. So let's go ahead and start it. So I have uh, two matrices, matrix A uh, and matrix B, okay? So I already have done it manually, uh, addition, subtraction, and uh, uh, multiplication. And now I will use my calculator, 991 MS, to do it uh, in a calculator, okay? Let's go ahead and start to do that. So first of all, just on your calculator and then you have to go to your mode button in your calculator, press mode one time, second time, third time, okay? Then you will see the equation mode, matrix mode and vector mode. You have to press 2 to make your calculator in ready to do the matrix. Now your calculator is set for matrix mode. Now you have to go to write the whole matrix. Here I'm gonna tell you another things that uh, in maximum you can do a 3 by 3 matrix operation in this calculator. So 3 row, 3 column matrix operation. Okay. So now my calculator is set for uh, matrix mode. Now you have to shift, uh, press shift and then you have to go all the way to four here you see the yellow one so this is called the right matrix button so you have to press four to write your matrix now now you can see here i have three mood now dimension edit and three matrix so first of all i have to press one uh, one for the matrix dimension before putting dimension you can uh, give the name of your matrix. So your first matrix, let's say, is A. Now they are asking you for dimension M cross N. That means uh, row cross column. So you have to first press the row number. So my matrix row number is 3. So I am putting 3 for M. You have to press equal. And then they are asking for column number, which is N. Again, this is 3 equal. Okay, so now you have to give the input value uh, of your matrix along the row. So I will put along the row. The number will come along the row. So it will come 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3. So this number, first number indicating row and second number is equal indicating column number. So so my first column one one number is one equal to then it's asking for second number in first row so two and then three so my first row is finished so it's now asking for second row so my second row is negative two four seven third row one zero negative three so this is done, my first matrix. So I already put my first matrix. Similarly, I will go ahead and put the second matrix B. So this one I will do a little faster for you. Here I'm gonna tell you a little bit. At first, it looks a little lengthy for you. 
maybe you don't like to do it at the first uh, first time because it looks lengthy then do it by hand but i'm sure if you do a little more practice you can do it much much faster and you will like it rather than doing it by hand so let's go ahead and put the second one so again i'll put shift i'll go the matrix button we'll put one one is oh sorry uh let's go ahead again uh matrix button one and i'll name it two actually b so again my dimension is three uh column number again three so my b matrix is two negative one five zero three one nine minus six two okay so now i put the input of my matrix now i'll do the operation addition first so i put already put my all the value there now i do not need to put this value again now i can use the same value for addition subtraction and multiplication okay so let's do first the additions so what you have to do put shift again in every matrix operation you have to go to this matrix here so now i have it have to go to three number three matrix not because i will do the operation my dimension is done edit i'm not doing any editing so just three uh, a matrix plus shift matrix again three two b matrix boom done my addition is done so now it's giving me the value again row wise so first row three you can match it with my value here three one eight negative two seven eight ten negative six one good again if you want to do the uh, subtraction shift uh, matrix three one minus shift matrix three two matrix subtraction okay okay let's match it uh, negative one three uh negative two negative two one six uh negative eight six negative five excellent okay so now this is the multiplication that's the one so if you want to just do the multiplication you have to go through this process put the matrix and uh, put the element everything and now you have to just do similarly uh multiplication as you did for addition and subtraction one so multiplied shift mat three two here you go so here again you see this uh, multiplication i can go ahead and check number by number three thirteen fifty nine twenty eight eight twenty five seventeen one okay looks good so again, I'm saying that if you uh, feel that it's too lengthy for you, you can just uh, do practice a couple of times. I believe you, you can uh, you can get the benefit of these operations. Okay, uh, thank you so much for watching. If you